In this tutorial in Cyberlink PowerDirector, we'd like to show you how to use the Mask tool to create a special kind of introduction to a clip. What I have on the screen is a short clip of a motorcycle race, and I'd like to begin it with using a mask introduction. I'm going to click on the clip in my timeline with the left mouse button. That will highlight it, and then I have a box that opens called Designer. Now normally when we click on this, we go right into our PIP designer, our picture in picture. But in this case, I want to click on the down arrow and choose the mask designer. So I'll pick that one up and immediately we get into my mask designer window. It comes loaded with a lot of predefined masks, but in this case, I don't want to use any of them. I want to create one of my own. So I'll click on create mask. That will open a second window, and in this window, it will give me the option of either loading an object or using a text mask. That's the one I want in this case. So I'm going to highlight the My Title, and we'll call this uh, Motorcycle Racing 2018. And so what I will do is I will go ahead and position that in the center. And what I'm going to do as well is I'm going to change my uh, font size. We'll make this a little larger. Let's see if we can hit 72 here and still fit it in the screen here. No, a little bigger. So let's try something closer to uh, 60. Now that That's not too bad. Okay, we can always stretch it if we want to. And then the other thing I want to do is I want to change my uh, uh, my letting on that, and we'll tighten up the distance between the the uh, the words here. That looks pretty good. Put it right about in the center, and then I'll stretch it a little bit bigger yet. So we'll cover most of the screen here. That's not too bad. And so this will be what I will use. I'll click on OK. And that moves me right back into my mask designer. Now, if all I do is want that, it creates something that is slightly usable, but not all I want. Let me show you, for example, here. If I play my clip. I can't see much because all I happen to see in this case is uh, the race behind the words. So let's go ahead and stop that and get back into my designer my mask designer. And this time we'll use some keyframing. What I'd like to do is I'd like to start this way, uh, position, scale, and everything. So I'm going to go in here and I'm going to click on my keyframe with my uh, position indicator at the left side for position, scale, and opacity. And I want these words to highlight what's behind it for let's go maybe, oh, two seconds. So at two seconds, I, I, I'm going to right click and, and click duplicate previous keyframe. So that'll be on the screen long enough for people to read the words easily. And then let's move over two more seconds to about the four second mark. And now I'm going to change it. We'll go ahead and we'll uh, zoom out make that pretty small, and then we'll just make this huge here. We'll enlarge it as big as it'll go. Well, that's maximum size right there. Okay, and now we'll go fit again. Okay, and this is what it will look like toward the end here. And then I'm going to ch keep the opacity. I'll right click and duplicate the previous keyframe. And then what I want to do is when it gets, when it expands to the size here, shortly thereafter, and we're just going to go over maybe a third of a second here, I'm going to go at this mark, and then we're going to take the opacity, and we're going to make the opacity of the mask zero, so it will fade out. And I'll click on OK. So now let's uh, go ahead and see what it looks like as we start our video. We'll go into movie mode and then we'll hit the play key. It's motorcycle racing and then it, it expands, explodes out, and then we get right to the uh, 
rest of the clip. So it's on the screen enough to add a nice little feature to it, but not enough to say, well, get out of the way. I want to see the video. So um, within four seconds, we've accomplished our objective using keyframes and the text masking tool in CyberLink PowerDirector. Thank you.